Welcome to Art Beyond Museum's special edition. Today, I'm very honoured. I have with me a very special and honoured guest, Her Highness Princess Nordom Chansita. Thank you, Princess, Thank for you. joining me. For your invitation. Thank you. Yes, so if you've been catching up, you know that Princess Chansita is a great friend of Lotus on Water and Masterin. So I definitely need to get her on the show to tell us something more about Masterin that we might not know. But exactly. First, yeah, oh, exactly. exactly. Okay, that sounds interesting. The cheers okay. first. Thank you, Princess. Thank you for your invitation. <laughs> yeah. So, let's bring back the clock. Um, how did Your Highness, how do you get to know Master Yun? Uh, it was um, it was a truly experience. I was in Cambodia. Right. And uh, my cousin, Princess Obato Tiso, right. has mentioned about um, uh, his trip to, uh, to, to Singapore right. and uh, he had the pleasure of uh, meeting uh, uh, Master Yu through the, a common friend, Monsieur Berthaud. Marcel. Marcel, Marcel Berthaud, Berthaud. Yeah. yes. So he was the first one um, uh, among my family to have met Mr. Uh, uh, Master Yun. And after my mother had also um, the chance of uh, right. uh, meeting uh, Master Yun, but all, all of those uh, small uh, little crowd, my mother and Princess O, it was happening in Singapore. And right. then uh, Master Yun uh, made a trip to Cambodia. After that? After that, first first trip to Cambodia, and this is how we we I have been introduced directly to Master Yun. Right. Oh, I remember. So it was when National Gallery of Singapore. Yes. Am I right? Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, yes. Invited uh, Princess Norlon Popa Devi. Exactly. She's exactly. Like, yes. She's like the god of the yes. arts. No? Yes. <laughs> they were doing a, a show about her her contribution to the Apsara dance. Exactly. The exactly. And. Yeah. Um, yeah. Mastering hosted her then? Mm -hmm. right. Correct. Correct. And uh, that event, uh, uh, Royal Highness and Prince Tessu were here. Mm -hmm. So when they went back and they brought back more tales, they said, oh, there's this person uh, called Mastering. You have to meet her, you have to meet him, right? Yes. So what, what did they tell you? That, uh, what impression did it give you before you met with Mastering? What did you hear say about him? Oh, just uh, only, um, only very in, um, in very inspiring thing that uh, he's a master Feng Shui. Yeah. Uh, I did not have a clue before what was Feng Shui. Yeah. Uh, so it was very interesting to um, to, uh, to, to, to discover uh, such a strong uh, temper. Uh, oh. He has a, a very strong character, Master Yun. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I was not really sure. I was thinking, oh, maybe, maybe, I don't know uh, how I should behave in front of uh, someone like him, which master. And uh, it went very well because I think we just we just had a very strong connection right. between between each other. Right, right So it right. went very well. I was <laughs> I, I was a little bit uh, anxious, but uh, yeah. actually it went very well, and uh, and and I was very happy that you know my mother and Princess O uh, told of me uh, for the introduction to Master Yu. Right, yeah. right, right. And then the friendship just went. And on. then the friendship just you know carry on until today. Right. Uh, nothing has uh, nothing has fainted. Yeah. Uh, I just think it's becoming stronger. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. After so, so many years. Yes. So we also know that uh, Princess, you are also a collector of Master Yu's art. Gives paintings. Indeed. Yes. Uh, which one do you remember? Yours was the. Uh, I, I, my one was the, 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 the was the fan. The fan. Yes. Yeah, the fan. The fan. Uh, the, the, the one I the one I picked from uh, the one that I picked from him. The fan has a lot of uh, maybe red color. Mm. Red and then yellowish color. Yes. I love uh, I love uh, strong strong color. Right. Yeah. So when you first saw Mastrin's art, do you remember what was your first impression of it? Uh, it was it was speechless mm -hmm. because I saw it in Bangkok ah, during yes. the exhibition in Bangkok. Our first yeah. overseas art exhibition yes, in yes, Bangkok yes. at the Angkor Thai and Angkor yeah. Princess uh, Popa Devi was there, mm -hmm. your good self, uh, Prince Shivan, Prince Vic, Prince Princess Vic. Rashmi. Exactly. Yeah. What else? Yeah, yes, think, Princess yeah. Soh. <laughs> Princess Soh. Of course, Princess Soh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, th yeah, that was the exhibition that it was. Uh, we exhibited the most number of paintings thus far. Mm -hmm. 108 paintings because even when we went out to the Great Wall of China, mm -hmm. We didn't have so many paintings. Mm -hmm. It was only fifty-nine. Mm -hmm. Actually, that means half, nearly half of uh, half, the Bangkok mm -hmm. uh, selections. And uh, it was the exhibition that had six royalty, six mm -hmm. members of yes, the Cambodian yes, yes, royal family that attended. So yeah, it was indeed, a milestone. Yeah. It was significant, and that was the first time you saw the art. It was the first time. Yeah. Right. It was the first time. So of that exhibition, what was the most memorable moment? Um. 
the end when Master Yun was performing. Oh, he's um, I mean, it's, how do you say it, right? How do you yeah, I, I, put I, it? I, I don't know how to describe it because it oh, was really. Uh, was he writing or was he? No, uh, no, what? he just uh, got out his um, his um, how we say that um, in English. He, <laughs> he, the, he, you know, yeah, it's it's uh, dusting, yeah, yeah. The, the dusting, yeah. I think we do call that right, dusting. Right. So we just got out, uh, got out his you know sh huge long uh, uh, stick yeah. with the dust, and then he started to do the the whipping. Yeah, the whipping on the on the on the painting, right. and all of those gold leaves yeah. just was were flying everywhere. Right, you know, and then some of them just arrived to us, yeah. and those who were in the back. They yes. were like rushing in front, <laughs> trying to get some, you know, to put on on top of, of their face, oh, everything. The painting. The was painting. There. The it painting. was full of gold. Yes. And yes, uh, yes. in that segment, mm -hmm. Princess, you are describing is that Master Yun took out that duster, exactly, yeah. the Buddha yeah, duster, yeah, yeah, yeah. and he started to whip it. Mm -hmm. So gold was everywhere. Mm -hmm. But, Your Highness, you, all of your set very still, right? But people at the back just came forward. And what happened after the whole thing? Oh, we were, I think we were just blown away. He has explained that first of all, he put some champagne right, inside yes. those inside those those those, uh, paintings, yeah. those paintings, and then when all of those gold, the twenty-four carat gold, or you know, it was like flowing everywhere, and it was some some tourists around, some uh, there are some uh, Thai people, mm -hmm. they were just like trying to rush and. And, and they were very curious. They didn't understand what's happening, so they were just uh, looking. And when they saw all of those gold uh, leaves <laughs> flying, they, they, they were trying to, to, to right, grab yeah. it. Yeah, they one tried to grab it. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, uh, they wonder on them. So good luck. Uh, yeah, I think so. Things, uh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. great. I think it's great energy. I remember I was at one corner, quite far away. Mm -hmm. I saw one. I might be one of the person who attended the opening ceremony, or might be a passerby. She opened up. Her Hermes bag, a pouch, and then she put it. <laughs> <laughs> which is fun, which is fun. So you know, there's an element uh, of fun and prosperity mm -hmm. inside Masterin's arts as well. So from then, you know, you went on to attend several of, of other Masterin's art exhibition. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm curious. I just want to uh, hear from Your Highness. What's Masterin's friendship with, let's say, the uh, late Her Royal Highness Princess Kupa Devi like? I understand that they have a strong friendship. Yes, um, you know my um, my 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 mother, uh, my mother speaks um, uh, Khmer and French, no, and, and, very and little and English. Very little English. She can understand, but um, oh, she, she it's she's not used to uh, use the language, the English language. And master speaks Chinese and English. English. Yeah. So uh, they were uh, speaking to each other with hand. Really. Uh, just I think the communication was really intense. Uh, was great. Because oh. the, the the bond between both of them, I really don't know where it's come from. It right. just you know ju just something. I think they just had to they had a crush. Uh, they had the crush on each other. Even though really. the language was a barrier. barrier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a language barrier, but, but. that there's some some is something much more uh, deeper. Right. That no need to to share the same language. I see. My, I, see. I think my mother was very fond of him. And every time Master uh, uh, invited her, she always found a, a way to come here. Yes. So she, 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 she loves, I think she just loves um, the, 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 the perspective of traveling to come here. And I think she, she likes to do the gallery. Yeah. Because um, you, 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 you feel something very, um, uh, very peaceful. Yes. You know, very, and you know, she's a Buddhist. She's right. a Buddhist prat uh, practicant, so when she comes here, she she loves she loves because she just feel uh, she just feel um, satisfied. Yeah, she, somehow. She, yeah, yeah. Can, yeah. Even though the language yes, is yes, very, but yes, the, yeah, yeah. when they speak, when mm. they communicate, the energy can flow, huh? Mm. Exactly, exactly. And uh, the friendship was, mm. Uh, mm. you know, I saw Master Yuan speak with uh, Princess Pupa Devi before. Like each was speaking their own language. Sometimes Prince Tesla is around to translate. Yes, to translate. Yeah, yeah but most of the time, as if the uh, the message can go beyond the words. That's was something that, and uh, you know, mastering he's a feng shui artist. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Of course, yes. uh, her royal highness Princess Papa Devi was definitely an artist, mm -hmm. and uh, it's as if two artists they can speak on different plane yes. together yes. and yes. communicate. Yes, correct. That's mm -hmm. really something. So, of all the exhibitions uh, that your highness you mm -hmm. have been to. Which might be your most favorite one? Uh, or memorable, I, uh, yeah. memorable. I, 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 mu I must have to say it at the chance. Okay. Yeah, it was. It's wonderful. The place 
it's wonderful. I, I love those old stone, the, yeah. the old, the, I mean, this, this yeah, architecture, you know, the feeling of that, that, that place used to have a story before. Yes. And then uh, I, I will remember all my life, just, you know, all of those paintings at time. I mean, so the, the uh, uh, first, um, uh, first, first, uh, first pleasure, personal pleasure was, of course, in Thailand, yes. because it was the first time yes. that I've seen something like that. But then after, if I have to pick one, I mean, my favorite will be a charm. Right. Yeah. Okay. Will be a charm. It's one fantastic. Uh, the, the chimes is also the yeah. place. Mm -hmm. I mean, is it compared to Cambodia? Of course, but Singapore has much less historical place. Mm -hmm. But chimes is one of them. No, chimes is one of them. One Definitely. Of them. Definitely. Uh, significant one. Mm -hmm. And also, do you know that actually it was at Chimes Hall that one of the scenes of the crazy rich Asian state. Oh book, yes, I remember. It was at the hall. I remember. Yeah. I remember. I remember. So I remember. the the one that Princess you're talking about is the one that we did it together with Eric, right? Exactly. Eric exactly. Eric was there. Yeah. And uh, yeah. we had the fashion mm -hmm. show going on. Mm -hmm. Probably we were the only ones who actually brought such a fashion show to this place. Chimes to this called. place, yeah. yeah but so it did. It, it well. It I think it was well deserved. Yeah. You know, so, so for the place, for Eric, for Master, yeah. uh, to I mean it was really the. Um, uh, the, 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 the great pick, yeah. just time. You know, is I know there's so many other places in Singapore yeah. uh, which can compete, but for me, charm is the best. We look forward to doing mm. the show there again. Yeah. So you know, princess, uh, it seems that you have known Marston for quite some years. Mm -hmm. Then, since the first time you met him, since Princess so met him, how would you describe, from your perspective, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. how would you describe Marston, this person, not the artist, yeah. but the person? Oh, I think um, we uh, he has a very strong temper, mm -hmm. which uh, I think this is one, uh, one 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 thing I really like about him, because I also have very strong temper. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it just it, I think it's just his character, yeah. the character. He's some he's someone very very honest. Yes. And uh, if he if he likes you, if uh, if uh, if uh, if he want to share something with you, it's. It's very sincere. Right. Yeah, it's very sincere. It's not a person who will just you know, go around and uh, just speak out to say it, um, uh, something he doesn't mean. Right. You know? So everything, as um, uh, as his thoughts, his um, uh, his gesture, his loves, uh, need to be shared with with someone that he really has a respect for and. Uh, Consideration, yeah. passionate, honest, passionate, yeah, passionate, honest, direct, yeah, yeah. and strong. Yes, yeah. I suppose that because I I ask your highness this question is that because sometimes we look at a piece of art, we get a lot of feeling from it, but when we know the artist, the character, and the temperament mm -hmm. and disposition, then through this and we look at a piece of art again, then we say ah, I can find the characteristics of the artist manifesting on the artwork yes. and therefore getting closer to the mm -hmm. artwork as well. Yeah, it's, uh, it, I, I, I just think that you know the way he is, you can you can really see it through his painting. Yeah, you know, it's it's really strong. I mean, the colors together, everything. Uh, I have not seen anything of his painting from the pickup mm -hmm. through the the fan, and now he has another kind of like another style. Calligraphy, yeah, yeah calligraphy, which is I mean, each style, it's uh, it's it's really talking about the way he is. Yes, the way he is the strong, way. strong, strong. Yeah. So that means that. If there's one key word that Princess you feel about mastering this person and his art, it's strong. Strong, uh, kindness. Kindness. Kindness, you know. That's um, good balance. I mean, you're strong yes, and you have yes, the kindness yes, as well. Yes, yes. Yeah. You can be you can be strong and kind. It doesn't mean you're weak. Of this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very well. Yeah. yeah. There are some people. Um, I mean, some 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 people are always thinking that uh, being kind is being weak. It's not true. Okay. You can be you can be kind and be nasty. Uh -huh. You can be kind and be nice, and you can be weak, and be also uh, uh, not reflecting on uh, a very good character from 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 who you are. You know, yeah. so we just we we, we should not uh, uh, confuse uh, uh, kindness and weakness. Right. Yeah. Right. It's yeah. great. Great that we actually find uh, the, the the parallel or the balance of uh, strength and uh, great kindness mm -hmm. in Mastuin and his yeah. artwork. Thank you very much, Princess, Thank for sharing. I, I mean, great insights because it always benefits everyone to hear something more about Master oh, it's, and his it's arts. Yeah. My pleasure. You know, since um, my mother passed away on uh, in November 2019, 
uh, we, 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 we had the chance before to talk a lot and to right. share many things between the mother and daughter about uh, Master Yun. And I will, uh, I will, I think it's my duty, I, will, I would love to carry on this friendship uh, with Master Yun um, for my mother also. Yeah. I think she, she would, she, I mean, whoever she is, maybe in the royal family paradise, yeah. she will she will love you know, to see exactly what's happening now. Yeah. I'm sure the royal highness yes. will be very pleased. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Thank you, Princess. Thank Cheers. you so much. Yes. Sante. Sante, like we said. Thank you so much. Yes, thank you. My name is Eric Rezina, I'm a fashion and textile designer. This October from 26 to 28, I will be exhibiting my fashion with Master Yun uh, Feng Shui paintings. So make sure that you uh, mark this calendar because everything is going to be about friendship, prosperity and elegance. So see you there. The Arts Beyond Museums series and Master Yun Longzi's Feng Shui Art are proud to be sponsored by Lohong Perrier. For 200 over years, Lohong Perrier has not worked with any other artist before. When you purchase a piece of Feng Shui Art exhibited in this Art Beyond Museums series, you will also be getting a complimentary set of five different specially selected cuvées of Lohong Perrier Champagne. De La Cove, De Cove Rosé, Brut Millesimi, Demisec Harmony, and De Cove Grand Siac. So that you can enjoy the taste of elegance while basking in the prosperity of Mastuin's feng shui paintings and calligraphies. Cheers to prosperity and elegance.